think that's working. <clears throat> Hello, boys and girls. <clears throat> Hi, kids. Hello, everybody. No, no, no. Mr. Stephen, hmm? I hope I'm not interrupting. Yeah. But why on earth are you talking to your iPhone? I'm practising my lines, Basil. What do you mean, practising your lines? Mr. Stephen, we finished our UK tour two weeks ago, and I think that walnut you have as a brain has finally cracked. No, Basil. I'm doing a pantomime. Yeah, it's Jack and the Beanstalk at the Anvil in Basingstoke. Oh, I see. Very well done, Mr. Stephen. Uh, who are you understudying? Well, I'm not understudying anyone. I have my own part. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm playing Simple Simon, Jack's comedy brother. D did you say comedy brother? Yeah. So that involves you being funny? Yes, Basil, it does. And the director picked you? Yes, he did. Oh, well, I suppose all the A-listers are booked up at this time of year. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, you know, the likes of James Corden, David Walliam, Simon Pegg. I bet they're too busy. Mm. Well, I guess they are, Basil. Mm. What about Ronnie Corbett? The director said no. Jimmy Cricket. The director said no. The one with the dog. They wanted me, Basil, yes. not the one with the dog, or a unicycling juggler, or even evil flaming Edna. The director picked me. Ooh, all right, keep your hair on. <laughs> what you've got left at the back there. <laughs> so, anyway, who is the director? Me. And it's going to be magical. <laughs> You're the director. No wonder you gave yourself the part. Listen, Mr. Stephen, that is wonderful. Good luck, old chum. You're going to be brilliant, you know. And um, since you're a director, mm -hmm. any chance of a small part for a little fox? Well, I'll have to talk to the director. Yeah, well, I don't want it because I'm at Windsor. Boom, boom, ta-da! <laughs> right, lights, camera, 